Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Design Centric SimCity. This is episode 8.1. It's the first episode with decimals that I'm doing. And the reason why it's because I want to finish the city so I can move on to the next one in episode 9. Um, last episode was pretty long and apparently some people liked it. So this might be long too. I really want to get this city finished no matter how long it takes. I hopefully, hopefully it will be less than 40 minutes um, or an hour, <laughs> but uh, we'll see. We'll see how it works. So as usual, uh, I'm not happy with this part right here or any part that I build and I want to demolish right away. So what I'm going to do is this train station is going to disappear. I'm going to refactor this entire neighborhood and maybe reconnect that to our new industry that now has bigger factories providing more jobs. So if you look at the details, we have quite a few jobs available and we need some residential demand to fulfill that. Let me look at my taxes real quick. I want to put back this to 11 so I can make some money. And uh, unfortunately, the trade depot will go because I don't want to have this curve and like double curve here. So I'm going to actually leave this train station and just make the road straight and then connect here and maybe even connect it to this part over here. So the tree depot is gone. So it's gone as well. There seems to be slope here. I guess it's fine. No big deal. For now, you know me. I want to change everything all the time. I want the guides helping me here. Thank you. That looks okay. This road is gone. So I'm thinking, what if I... This was measured properly, if I remember correctly. Yes, indeed. I'm gonna do the same here, and I'm I want to maximize this whole neighborhood. Just so I have there we go room for high density buildings eventually. So. What I'm, I'm going to achieve here, or at least I'm going to try to, is having some high density development going on in this whole strip right here, facing the ocean. I was thinking whether or not to maybe move this station up here and build another one here to service this area. I haven't decided that yet, but it's just in my mind, just so you know. connect this this way this is a huge bottleneck ride here I should probably fix that Now that I have four ways, this is going to become more problematic. This sucks. This sucks. I'm okay with this. Not stoked, but just okay. I need more ways to connect this to this. 
Maybe... Well, now it's like totally isolated and everything, all the traffic has to flow through this street here. I think I need a side road the way I used to have it before. Do this, it's gonna destroy that factory. Let's go high speed. Another solution would be to start putting buses. That's probably a smart decision. There's something that I want to do here, maybe something cool. Let's see how this works. So if I do this, I'm gonna redo this part, just not to have this weird intersection here, but maybe I can put a cool park in between. Really? You're not gonna let me put a park there? Okay, I can do this instead. Nope, not that. Don't I have room for two of these? One on each side? Come on. Let's do this. So this has to go straight for a little while, which is not doing it right now. Yes, goodbye. And now we can build this. Oh no, so close. Maybe I can do this, and I now I can do... nope. Not letting me do anything there? Okay. Just that. So now it's a cool entrance to the train station. That will probably cause more traffic issues than before, but at least it looks nice. No, I don't want to do that. Okay, let's try one more thing. Try this on an angle right about here. Now a simple curve. There we go. Everybody happy. It's just doing well. Now I have two axes that don't interrupt the traffic on the main avenue. And uh, I think I can pull those those and make it better now. Okay, so this is shaping up pretty good. How are we doing that employment wise? We have a ton of jobs. We definitely need more need more people here. So let's take care of that. Guides on, thank you. These guys are not helping me very much. I know I want that in that way. What if I'm gonna do something crazy here? What if just do like Not gonna work. I can feel it. Terrible idea. Oh, wow, look at that traffic. It's insane. Would it help if I draw two roads and continue this nice little 
Boulevard. This side? We'll see. See, this would be a great spot for, for an hour pass. But I'm not going to waste time doing that right now. Especially since the new tool is coming up soon. Do I have more abandoned buildings? Yes, I have one more house here. Go away. See how this looks now. Really like this entrance. Maybe if, if I can do more like smaller roads like this. This help a lot, a little. So I think this intersection should be right about here. Let's correct that. Medium density, high density, all those is two. Connect here. Bam, there we go. So now I have a ton of small roads driving traffic to this industrial area, which is probably a really bad idea, but it looks cool. Does it? I think it looks cool. It's very organic. And the cool thing is that this small roads have stop signs on the avenue so cars don't really you know cars driving on this main avenue don't really have to wait until they can continue ahead and this is always this is probably going to get a lot better now that i'm going to start placing some actually wait what kind of demand do i have low wealth so I think this this can fit population. There we go. Residents. Okay, this is fine for now. I don't want to have a lot of medium wealth. I prefer to have low wealth. Maybe this is a little bit too much parks, a little bit too many parks. Let's bulldoze this. Did that increase or reduce the radius? Yes. So what I want now is residential here and here. Actually, all the way. Then I'll figure out what to put in the middle if I need more zones. What about the line value here? This is all, I'm gonna get rid of this. So now this is all low wealth. And this, this whole area will be medium wealth. Let's check out the jobs. We have a ton of jobs available for low wealth residents. To rezone this, actually this could be commercial because it's Probably a PC area. There we go. On their way to work. That always works good. Commercial loves it. This would be a great 
Ender Pass or Tunnel whenever I have the option to do that. Hopefully in a couple of episodes I'm going to be able to do that. Oops. So this is growing pretty well. Now this looks like a city. Let's reduce the speed of the simulation. And uh, I think what I'm going to do next is start dealing with buses. I, th I think people need to get to work without driving a lot. So, oh, by the way, I've never placed park and rides in the city. And I think that will improve a lot uh, the efficiency of my train stops, stations. Uh, so maybe one here. Did I put bus stops? I did put bus stops. No, this is the first. Let's look here. Oh, I never fixed this. I need to take care of this. Pronto. So I have no excuse now. Okay, I have an idea. Let's do this. I think I like this one better. And I'm probably going to extend this. Just put a little pond in the middle. Can I fit this? Nope. Okay. Just this one. There we go. And now I'm going to close the loop with this road right here. Great. And uh, this should do something with this. Should I end this here? Does this look totally weird? Looks a tad weird. Okay, let's do this. Let's put some. Nothing can grow in here. That's a problem. I think this will end up looking like this. Boxy and square. Don't throw out, boy. Um, simply because it just looks nice. Like the park fits perfectly. In fact, I have an idea. I bulldoze this here and put a pond. Can I fit a pond here? Probably not. Nope. Okay. Actually, let's just say it like that. It looks nice. Some random grass. Yeah, this is fine. Okay, park and rides. Back to park and rides. Where's the other station? Um, why is nothing growing here? So maybe this is a great spot for a park and ride. Now all I need is a bus depot, which should be located in a non-critical area of the city. Wow, look at the traffic. This is insane. I need one, uh, one road that sort of connects here because it will be a little bit crazy otherwise. Um, so park and ride, park and ride, park and ride, park and ride. Like, I don't need a park and ride here because I don't want people driving here. So let's do one park and ride in this whole area so people can drive from wherever they are. Let's just put one here and one here. 
one on each side. And this area they want to, they're they're probably gonna like having a parker right here. enough okay now let's do some bus stops okay, this neighborhood is covered I wish I could do one-way streets here. Let's place one here, here, one here, and one here. That sort of covers everything. This loop I want stops to be inside, like so. This is all pretty much covered. That's good. So bust up here on this main drag. Actually, I think this could be upgraded now. Or sorry, population, uh, population. Population. Okay, this is now going to be medium density. Because it deserves to be medium density. It connects a lot of neighborhoods. And it's only fair. That means it will support bus stops as well here maybe here this is all well covered seems can walk from here to here i don't mind if they drive from here to here that's fine let's see where else this neighborhood is not covered at all now it is it's on the outside That's it, it's covered. The whole city is pretty much covered. Uh, yep. Okay, now what I need is a bus depot. And the bus depot could live somewhere quieter where it doesn't bother and it doesn't look bad. Maybe here at the entrance. Unless I do a regional. Regional is more expensive, but I have money. Yeah, let's do regional. I have plenty of room here. And this is a medium density avenue, so it's perfect. People will come into the city, park here, and take the regional bus. Let's just add a bunch of those. mandatory sign there we go so it's right at the entrance cars can come in whenever I build the next city can get inside park and take the bus wherever they go so there you have it our city is growing pretty well and then this time you know what I'm actually happy what's going on here okay I'm no longer happy that didn't last long no, I'm, I'm joking I am happy it's funny how in the last episode I said I didn't really have time, which it was which it was true. I really didn't have a lot of time to build a city, but I got carried away and it ended up being a super long episode. Okay, let's do let's do Chidia so I can see progress. So good traffic. So traffic is good, it's only 3 p.m. but now rush hour is going to start at I think at 5 p.m. and it's gonna be hella crazy is this working already good 12 buses let's get that real quick not a lot of people are waiting at the bus stops they're probably gonna I don't know if they fixed already or they were saying they're gonna fix this conga line of buses. So 
So this is good. We have plenty of workers. With growing buildings. Traffic is getting better. Let's see if the train is being used more. It's 300. This one is not being used that, long, that much. This one is... 5... 800. It's getting more. This one is not... Not a lot of tall buildings here anyways. How do I... How can I increase these people's happiness? I think more parks will do the trick. Just want to fill this in. Yeah, I can still, I can't blow parks, but it's still charging me for them, even though I can. Because if I do here... Oh yeah, I think it's also charging me if I do it there. Yeah, this is like a line of no trees. It's no tree zone. It's business. Fire department. Too slow? Yeah, I hear you. But you have two unused engines. Three unused engines. Go on. Don't be like that. Okay, I'm gonna force this to grow if I can. Let's just put another park here. And here. And that's it. No more parks can... Oh, actually, wait, wait. Nope. I see blue dot there. Come on. That should have increased their happiness. Yes, there you go. That's quite a bit of happy sims. It's very cool parks in front. Whoa, what was that? It's that tree floating in the middle of... There are like random trees floating. Look at that. Yeah, this is awesome. Graphic glitches. Not to be confused with the B word. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. You have to understand that sometimes I don't really know what to say. So just say random things. Which is probably a good idea. It's probably not gonna not a good idea. I should probably shut up. What else is abandoned? Show me. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. A lot of traffic here, but not 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 critical. I mean, it is sort of orange red at times. But I would be worried if it was red all the time and people would tell me that they don't have, they didn't find jobs. Look, look how much all this dropped. See the use. 1800 riders. What about trains? 2000. This is perfect. This is working really well. I don't know about you, but I'm happy with the results so far. Why is this not growing? Probably because this zone is very 
Yeah, it's like, whatever. We're not gonna grow, we're not that happy yet. But you know what? I'm gonna make you happy. This will go away. What do I need? I need... Medium wealth, eh. Sure, why not? Let's put that part back. Is this like on the tracks? Nope. It is not. So I don't know why I have this now. I can easily just do this one road here. And get it over with. Get it over with it. I feel like this is too boxy now. Maybe if I do like some curls here and here. Let's see how that looks. Connect this somehow. Of course. Might need to relocate those services. That looks okay. And if I okay. I'm gonna put my clinic somewhere else that it could maybe have. Like I'm not using this road for anything. I must might as well just put my clinic here because it will have plenty of room to expand. I don't know if putting it on an avenue is a good idea, but what's done is done. I'm gonna place all the ambulances on this side street. Put this here. Actually not not there, but slightly to the right because I want more room. Actually I don't need more room for ambulances. Okay now this is located right in the middle of the city, which is helpful, and I can do the same with fire station. So it's a pretty central location where they can go anywhere they want. And now I can... Is it open yet? Fly... They're still hiring, right? This one is open. So I can bulldoze a clinic already. There we go. There we go. So get rid of the fire station here. And get rid of the clinic. And get rid of this ugly road. So now I can easily zone this. Some commercial here. Now it looks cool. So this is all medium wealth, low wealth. What do you need? This is fine. I need more of these. Not a lot. You were doing well. Look at all the windmills in the back. I gotta be honest with you, I'm not a big fan of the nighttime in SimCity. I just like daytime. You can see better, it looks better. 
this doesn't appeal to me at all. Every time I see screenshots of nighttime, I like in my mind I just skip them because they're like, oh, it's just a lot of dark and some lights on. I feel like it's easier to cheat good things when you're nighttime. You now it's 5 a.m. You can sort of start seeing something. Some of the lights are still on. I yet have to upgrade this to High Density Avenue, but I don't think I want to. I mean, it's still doing pretty well without it. But I, th I do think I want to refactor this whole area because this curve here makes no sense. Why would why would I have this? And actually, this road doesn't make any sense either. And now I have a Ford intersection. You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of all this. Bam! Bye. Sorry about that, but it's the truth. Like. What buildings? What are you talking about? Are you considering... Oh, man. Really? There we go. There we go. So this should be... Uh, this building is going to go away. This building... Maybe not. Need the guides again. This is here. Do I need to do this? Yeah. But now this doesn't match this. And that is important to me. Why? I don't know. But it's just is. That's fine. How oh, maybe this should be high density, high density, so it sort of matches the color, I guess, medium. Let's just bring back. This cannot be downgraded, so it's fine. Let's do this. This. we can do some commercial in this area. Nothing high density is going to grow here, but... Just play some coal parks in there. Maybe extend this one to the side just a tad. Like so. There we go. Have some medium going on. All right, looks cool now. And now it's developing pretty well. This will bring a lot of happiness to this neighborhood. Let's see how we're doing in terms of jobs. This is fine. Now we're lacking in health. Well, of course we are. What about fire? Fire is fine. Crime in progress. 
Maybe it's time to upgrade my police department a little bit. Oh, I need, yeah, I need to upgrade the jails. There we go, plenty of room. I need more clinic capacity because now it's serving a lot more people. Train stations. Wow, 2,000. There we go. Now people are really using the trains. 4,000 people. What about buses? 4,000 people. Perfect. I love it. I mean, we have 84,000 people in the city, but that's a good start. Now we have unemployed people. There's always something. It's okay, some people are going to start commuting to the city next door. That might ease some of the issues. Let's just look at the city real quick. It's looking good. Still profitable. Traffic is okay. Let's just wait until one more rush hour just to make sure that everything's latest changes are being applied well. Rush hour will start in five, one seconds. There we go, rush hour. Traffic spray green. Getting some red here, some red here, red here, red here. Red here. All these streets are kind of a There's a lot of people walking, right? Let's just go on normal speed. Or just llama speed. Huge profits. I wonder if are, are these happy? Not enough room. Business is okay. Business is okay. Making profit. Good. I am glad. Why are you stuck here? Why don't you like drive? I wish I could plant some trees here, but it wouldn't let me. Seems like there's like a virtual line somewhere here. See, it allows me to plant trees here, but not in that spot. If anyone knows what the deal with that is, or if someone already reported that bug, I forgot to do it. But please let me know, because I'm interested. I want to make my city beautiful by planting more trees, and I can't. They're tree blocking me. Anyways, this is good for now. All that work paid off. The city is functional. It doesn't have a lot of traffic. It does. But the mass transit system is helping a lot with that. We have almost 90,000 sims in the city. We have some rubble. What else? What else do we have? Building, building fire. I might have to put another fire station somewhere. But the city is looking pretty good. I'm happy with how it works. The layout. It's an interesting layout. It looks kind of like a racetrack. I mentioned that in my previous episode. We're 45 minutes in. But I'm happy. And you know what the cool thing is? In the next episode, we're gonna do this. We're gonna come here and do Twain. And in Twain, 
we're gonna do some cool high tech and more skyscrapers. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do here. So stay tuned. Don't forget to subscribe. There's a big red button next to my name if you haven't subscribed yet. Tell your friends, like our Facebook page, and I keep saying R, which is only me. It's a Facebook page. Um, also, go watch the, if you haven't already, there's a design duel that I'm doing with Sat, which is actually really cool. He's building one city, I'm building another one, and then we're gonna have people vote which one is the coolest. And it's also design oriented. It's not just a random city. And Sat's doing some pretty good things. You might wanna check that out. And um, yeah, thanks for watching. This is the end of Elm Grove in the next city. We're gonna go next door and keep expanding this region.